epidemic in the suburbs has gotten a lot of attention. Off the top here at six, a reminder that the city has a battle of its own. This picture taken by a Detroit woman who is tired of seeing signs of drug abuse uh, near the place where children play. Sean Lay live with what she and others are trying to do about it. Sean. Devin and that woman is a mother and she says there's kids all over the neighborhood. First, she's finding dirty needles in the lawn. Then she finds a man, as you saw in that picture, oh. passed out right here. Then she called 911 and took her phone out to make a point. Almost this whole block, every house almost has kids. The corner of Pitt and Pearl in southwest Detroit is where Jessica Miller Ramirez uses her house as a safe haven for when kids get off the school bus. She runs her own nonprofit, Detroiters Helping Each Other. But last week, she says she saw something alarming. We caught one of our neighbors, neighbors is selling the bags of needles for $5 to the heroin addicts out here. Then she found a bunch of dirty needles next door. Thank God the gentleman here you know, checked the yard and was picking up the trash and seeing the needles because otherwise a kid would have got poked with a needle. Monday, Jessica found something else. He was just laid out. This man passed out around the corner. She called 911 and then she snapped this photo of him. EMS helped the man come to and then he started talking to Jessica. It was open that he's from Canton. His mom had passed away. He started to come down here. The photo is shocking. A devastating look at the heroin epidemic passing out right at Jessica's home. Ramirez says the man revealed he recently relapsed, had just shot up and was open to getting help. And I told him I was going to share a story about it, and he goes, maybe it will help somebody. That's what he said. Such a hard photo to look at, but really brings the point home. Look, Jessica says she has friends in the neighborhood that are involved in drug treatment. She says she connected this man right to them. She's only hoping that he went to them. Guys, back to you. Well, Sean, has that man been back in the area, or do they know? Yeah, not back in the air. She has not seen him back in the neighborhood. She either a hopes uh, he took her advice and went to the drug treatment yeah. or went right back home to Canton. Yeah. All right, Sean.